From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Adam Hammond with your morning headlines. Breaking overnight, a man is arrested after stealing an ambulance from Vanderbilt University Medical Center. This is crazy. Police say an officer tracked down the Rutherford County ambulance on Murfreesboro Road, which is when the driver put the ambulance in reverse and crashed into a patrol car and then drove into a wooded area nearby. The guy was arrested on multiple charges. The officer is OK this morning. Also breaking overnight, officers are looking into whether speed was a factor in this crash that left two people badly injured. This happened on Highway 70 South near Hicks Road on the west side of town. The driver was trying to make a left on Hicks Road when they lost control, hit a tree there. The man and woman were taken to Vanderbilt with critical injuries. Say goodbye to free parking in downtown Clarksville. Starting October 1st, you will have to pay a dollar for the first hour of parking. Right now it's free. After the first hour, it's going to cost you $2 for every additional hour up to three hours. And right now on NewsChannel5.com, Metro Nashville mayoral candidates Mayor David Riley and Councilman John Cooper go head to head during their first televised debate of the runoff. Big topics include their stance on raising property taxes and tackling problems related to schools. See our coverage right now on our website newschannel5.com. Now let's get a check on our forecast with Leland. Around the Mid-South for the morning time. Well, on, the, on this Tuesday, mostly cloudy, a couple of spotty showers. Cold fronts on the way as we head into the late morning hours into the afternoon. Scattered showers and thunderstorms develop. While one may be on the strong side, nothing widespread severe. Behind this, less humid air on the way. Highs in the mid-80s for the rest of the week, but temperatures at night, upper 50s to low 60s.